everyone and welcome back. I'm so sorry that I haven't uploaded on this channel in the past two weeks. I have just been trying to focus on planning some videos so that I had some more um, properly precise videos, if that makes sense. Um, I just wanted to make sure that I actually put my ideas in on papers because it kind of just felt like I didn't have any ideas when I had loads of ideas. Um, but I did upload a video to my acting channel where I had written and performed a monologue But I'll put that in the description below if you would like to check that out um, it would be really cool if you did So what are we doing today? What we're doing is we're letting Siri pick my makeup and it is actually 10.07 at night So this is going to be amazing to do this late at night. I don't know why I decided to do it this late at night. I'm really tired so this could turn out horribly, horribly wrong. But you know what? Let's just give it a go. So let's just get right into it. So I have numbered everything um, like this and the two looks very awkward. But I have numbered everything. I only have two different foundations but I have like some other things like all numbered out here you know i have like lipsticks numbered that you can't even see but there you go you can see now um there is some things that i only have one of like um concealer and setting powder but everything else we have lots of so we can you know give it a go so first we're gonna go with foundation so city pick a number between one and two it's one. Great! Okay, so number one is the Rimmel London Lasting Finish one, if you can see that there. So I'm just gonna, you know, I did put um, moisturiser on my face, so we're good to go. So I'm gonna, oh gosh, okay, just go in. What did I do? Never mind, found it. <laughs> so I'm just gonna go in with this. I do actually like this foundation. I usually put it on, you know, for like, if I'm going to work. Well, I don't really put makeup on for work because I prefer my sleep, to be honest with you. Um, no joke. Um, but yeah, I'll usually use this if it's just like a everyday kind of one. Um, I mean, I don't really enjoy the principle of MAC, found, like the MAC brand, because, you know, they test on animals still and, you know, I don't eat meat or anything. Um, but it was very expensive and I know that's like a really bad reason to still use it. But I got it like a few years ago and I just really like wanted to try it. But then I found that out. But it was like one of those like really pricey kind of foundations that I like want to use it all before I like don't ever use it again. Um, so actually, if any of you have any recommendations actually for, you know, affordable foundation that give you like full coverage, like please like leave them in the, descri the description in the comments below. You can tell I've like been away for a while because I can't even like talk correctly. And it's late and I'm tired, so you know, you can't really blame me here. <laughs> um, but yeah, because I really want to get like a new, bleh, a new foundation that like, one that doesn't go matte because I feel like when it's a really matte foundation, it just really emphasizes a lot of the things in my skin that you can't really see otherwise. Like it really makes my skin like really bumpy and I just, I'm not really a fan, but yeah, I really like, I did try the Essie Lauder one um, and I did actually really like that when I tested it, tested it. You know, when you got the little sample sizes, I really enjoyed that. Um, but again, it's really expensive. But yeah, if any of you have any good foundations that like do the trick, please hit me up. So I'm just like going to make sure I've got all this on my face because, you know, I don't want it to like look awful. I'm really interested to see how this goes because, you know, Siri doing my makeup. So as I said, I only have one concealer, which is the Revolution um, Conceal and Define Concealer in C65, which looks like, oh my gosh, <laughs> it looks like this. Sorry, the glare of that light is not helping at all. Um, maybe like, yeah, I probably shouldn't like, do videos this late ever again because I just feel like I'm talking like absolute nonsense but you know 
if you enjoy that, then you know, that's even better. Oh gosh, I put that way too high up on my head because I wasn't really paying attention. Yes, love that for me. Oh God, put way too much on my chin. <laughs> Loving this so far, guys. Okay, so I'm just gonna take the concealer. And actually, while we're on the topic of concealer, have you guys like, if you've watched some of my other makeup videos, like I don't know if you've noticed, but like I have said in the past that I hate doing my face first and I much prefer to do my eyes first because you know like it just like would save so much time and if there was fallout I would just like be able to get rid of it and clean it up. But since I've been doing like these makeup videos, I actually prefer doing my face first, which is like really unusual because I don't ever like have never liked doing that. Especially because if you make a mistake or you put an eyeliner on, you have to like not touch your face. And I'm like really bad for that where I'm like, plus I suck at eyeliner like so much. And I forgot to put concealer on my eyelids to like prime my eyeballs. So let's just like do that. So let's just quickly do that. And I know I'm actually really rambly in this video, but I hope that's okay. Just wanted to continue to talk throughout the video rather than it just be me going okay I'm gonna do this now and I'm not gonna say anything so hopefully that's okay so as I said previously I only have one setting powder and it's so grubby I'm so sorry it's also the makeup revolution um translucent powder um I'm gonna set my face the now or should I put should I put highlighter on no okay I'll like set oh christ sorry I'm, like spilling this everywhere like please never let me do a video like this late at night again so powdery yikes okay so we're just gonna wait a second and let it set in obviously i won't set it with setting spray just yet until we finished everything just want to get the prime areas you know set before we move on to the next step so let's just Get that out of the way. Got a bristle in my eyeball. Okay, so I think we're pretty much set. And sorry that I look like I'm like half dead a little bit because like I have my hair tied up, but you know, that's okay. <laughs> um, Sorry, I'm trying to get comfortable as I am sitting on the floor. So should we should do, move on to eyes. So, Wonderful, but yay, let's just throw that on the floor. So, oh my God, this was such a bad idea to do this so late at night. I'm really sorry. <laughs> but maybe, you know, maybe it's good because then it means I'm actually, you know, in with the video. What was even, I'm just talking so much BS. Right, let's move on to the eyes. So, I don't know, you can't, it might be back to front. Um, Maybe it might fix itself later on, but you know, I have one, two, three, four, five, six. Then I have just a couple of colors. I have purple, blue, red, pink, brown, and rainbow. Thought it'd be fun in case there was a little rainbow. Plus it is Pride Month, so you know, even better. So let's see what wizardry it's gonna give us now. Siri, pick a number between one and six. It's six. Six, okay, so we get to do a rainbow, yes! Okay, sorry, so sorry, that was probably really, really loud. We have so much colors to choose from. Okay, 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 right. I haven't really planned this part out very far. So I might have to. Okay, so what color did I use last time? I did write this down um, over there. Fun, okay, right, let's just go with it. I'm pretty sure, where is it? I used the purple in the mini controversy palette. Um, don't worry, I'll edit this bit out. <laughs> um, okay, actually. It's fine, I can edit it. <laughs> because I actually wrote the colours down. Right. Okay. So guys, I found my colour list. <laughs> I did a video before for Pixel Crunch that you will be able to get to see very, very soon, hopefully. And... I'm gonna follow the same colors or maybe use a different color because it actually turned out really well. So I wanted to use the same sort of colors. Okay, so we're gonna use, okay, I like to use, okay, this is the Conspiracy palette and I like to use the shade My Pills, which is this kind of light pinky shade. Sorry, I'm gonna like move closer. 
and I'm just gonna like dust that all over the eye for like the base and just do that again on the other eye I swear I really hope this eye look goes really well <laughs> this time like it did go really well before so now I'm going to <laughs> I'm gonna take the shade Flaming Hot from the same palette and I'm just gonna like do that you'll figure out what I'm trying to do in a second <laughs> I'm not very good at the whole tutorial not tutorial but like makeup explaining thing so I'll just do that right now <laughs> Oh no. Oh, that always happens, but it always goes up at the end. The edge, the edge. I said edge, but I meant edge. You know what I mean. <laughs> um, sorry. Just gonna get a towel there and just like. I don't know. I feel like it went a wee bit better before, but it's okay. It's okay. We can fix this. Now we're gonna go in with the shade Cheese Dust, which is a nice orange color, and. We're just gonna put it here. I think these colours work really well. I know it looks really bad right now, but I really hope it does, you know, pull through. I'm pretty sure it, it will because like it kind of looks like how it did the last time. So, you know, that's kind of reassuring. So now we're going to go in with the shade Food Videos, which is this yellow colour. And then we're going to just do the same thing and put it in here. Oh my Christ, I need to stop saying that. I just keep accidentally stabbing my palettes with the freaking end of the brush. Okay, sorry. Let's continue. I still think this looks, oh no, I nearly went in with orange again. That's <laughs> because I was looking at the orange part on my uh, eyes. Cannot talk, this was such a bad idea. And then we're going to go in with a different palette. <laughs> we're finished with that one for just now. Um, we're now gonna go in with the Bloodlust palette and we're gonna go in with the shade Serpent, which is a nice little, in a dark green. Just gonna place it there. Cause I wanna get all the shades kinda together. So this is what it's looking like right now. I know it's not really looking like much, but we'll get there. We will get there. Oh, I think I just covered up the yellow part, woo. So I'm gonna go back in with the yellow on that one. Oh my, my goodness, there's so many things, okay. Okay, this side might have flopped a little bit, but that's okay. It's okay, it's like 10 o'clock at night. I think this is okay for, for that. <laughs> um, so I think I have done the green part and yeah, okay. So now we're going in with the Blue Blood palette, yes, I'm, most of my palettes are Jeffree Star related. Um, I'm now going to take the shade Blue Monday from this palette and then just go in to, you know, put that in there. Okay, why does this left eye look so terrible? Okay. It kind of flopped, but it's okay. This eye's working out way better, so we can just focus on this one. Um, and now we're gonna go in with the Mini Controversy palette. And um, this is the newer one. Um, it just randomly appeared in my door, thanks to Greg. So I've not swatched this at all. So like, look how pretty that green is. It's so nice. Sorry, I got so distracted. So now I'm gonna go in with the shade Controversy. And I really hope I do not get myself into one of those because they do not sound fun. <laughs> so now I'm just gonna like take that shade and just, oh my goodness, it looks so bad. Okie dokie. 
I'm just gonna put it here. I mean, I don't think it looks too bad. I mean, it just kind of went a bit wonky over here. But there we go. So that is the eyes done. I mean, I kind of went a wee bit too far on this side. Um, I kind of like managed to kind of calm it down a little bit. Obviously this one flopped, so we'll just like pretend that didn't happen. <laughs> right, so it's fine. We can't change it now. It is what it is. So let's go for mascara. I got a new one and I'm really excited. So I really hope it picks that one. But if it doesn't, that's okay too. Because you know, it's Suri who's choosing this. Suri, pick a number between one and two. It's two. It's the new one. See, it's not a fix, I promise. It said two. <laughs> yes, I get to try my new Tropic Black Fixing Gel Mascara. Okay. I'm really excited to see how this goes. Oh, I love, there's just something so good about trying newly bought mascara. Oh, wowzers. Like, holy moly. Like, there's something so good about trying new mascara. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy with this. I just got it the other day, it was really quick. Like, I have such short eyelashes usually. Um, but whoa, this is really good mascara. I usually have, I mean, I have been using waterproof mascara because I cry a lot. But um, I really like this eye, um, <laughs> sorry. I really like this um, eyeliner, eyeliner, oh my gosh. <laughs> mascara because it's very volumizing. Um, it isn't waterproof, so it kind of has like stuck to my eyeshadow a little bit, which isn't so fun. Um, and not something I have missed when it comes to non-waterproof mascara. But that's okay, it just means it'll be easier to come off, which is a bonus. So anyway, without me rambling on, let's get on to highlighter. We have a lot of those too. Seri, <laughs> pick a number between one and seven. It's three. Ooh, let's see. Ooh, a liquid highlighter. And it is the Little Mix highlighter. It did say three, yeah. So this is number three, as you can see there slightly. Oh gosh, I'm not helping, but I think it did show up. Um, I'm not very good at using liquid highlighter. So like, I'm pretty sure I saw that someone kind of just went bloop, bloop, bloop. Like blip, blip, <laughs> what even was that? Blip, and then we'll just see how it goes from there. Oh, that's actually really pretty. Like, look at it. I don't even know why my voice went like that, but <laughs> here we go. Oh, I really like that. It's actually really pretty. Look, ooh, I'm glowing. <laughs> okay, I'm actually gonna just like. Get like a tiny bit on this brush and like oh no I put it on my actual lip but I meant oh, sorry I don't know why I made like a really strange noise <laughs> like please forgive me I don't know if, it, if this stuff works like on your nose but if it does like it makes it really good gl gl glittery then that's fine Ooh, I actually really like that. It's pretty. So now we shall go on to setting spray. I can't close this, this is fun. Okay, so now we're gonna do some setting spray and then we can go to the lips, which I'm excited about. Siri, pick a number between one and two. It's two. Ooh, so number two is the Makeup Revolution London the Hyaluronic Fix Hydrating and Plumping Makeup Fixing Spray. I haven't used this one in ages since I got the Morphe Jeffree Star one that smells of strawberries because it smells so good. This one smells very, very chemical, but as you can see this one, 
is number two. It looks more like a Z, I know. Please forgive me, I'm really tired. So this one does smell very chemically and I'm not like a fan of the smell, but it does a good job, I think, personally. So I'm just gonna like spray this on and hopefully I don't like spray it in my eyeballs. <laughs> Oh gosh, okay. Pfft. My face is like, I put way too much of that on, holy moly. Like my face is like soaking. <gasps> Guys, what did I do? Like, sorry, my sister's sitting over there. If you can hear her laughing, she's just like, it's because I'm using her phone. Oh Christ. <laughs> so yeah, you can hear her laughing in the background, but that's okay. We'll just like let this sit for a while. I'll try and help it along the way. I always, it's just because the other one doesn't spray very fast. So I usually put like, just like it doesn't feel like a lot when I put it on. Whereas I forgot that that one sprays out like really, really fast. At least I know that my makeup hopefully might be in place for me just to take it off in like two minutes. You know, like that's like really fun also. Just sorry, Jeffrey. I mean, not that Jeffrey will watch this, but like, you know, I'm really sorry that I'm just like waffing, waffing, whapping a mirror to, drying my face because I put way too much fix and spray on it. Okay, it feels a bit drier, it looks a bit drier, so you know, let's get on to lip liner before I just like have a breakdown. So, we only have two lip liners, so. Siri, pick a number between one and two. The answer is two. Ooh, number two is the Jeffree Star lip liner in Androgyny. I'm sure that's how you say it. I'm not very good at this either, so, you know, pray for me. So, yes, I am, I have been watching, I, I mean, a lot of people know who she is, but I've been watching a lot of Molly Mae's videos and I'm so related to something she said recently in her recent video where she was like, you know, I try my best to like give makeup advice, but you know, like this isn't really the place to ask for tips. And I felt that so hard, you know, like I just do makeup on the channel because I find it fun and I just like love messing around with it. But please do not ask me for tips or advice because I'm just as clueless as probably you are. And we're just learning together. So, and my hair is like falling out here. So let's just get into the lip liner. I'm literally not doing anything. I'm so scared to ruin this. So it looks awkward because I just lined them. So I know some people usually like line them fully, which I used to do. Like I used to really overly line them and just fill it in and I used to love it. And one time my grandma was like, oh my God, your lips look so full. And I was like, why do you do this more often? Well, that looked really creepy. I'm really sorry. That's not what I was trying to do. Um, moving swiftly on while well, I look like a clown. Hi, Bianca, I'm coming for your gig, boo. So anyway, I am sober think I'm mentally stable um it's just very late and I'm tired so anyway hang on wait okay I thought it was like on my chin not panic but it's not it's fine city pick a number between one and six it's three three guys no way no 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 city has picked a red lipstick a red Lipstick! Why does it hate me so much? I cannot pull off red lipstick. I look like a clown already. I fucked up the side. Please do not ban me for saying that. But I completely messed up the left eye. My lips went wonky on this side. I wet my face too much with setting spray. And now I have to wear freaking red lipstick. Please pray for me. 
going so bad. I'm actually so stressed. Right. Oh, I got it all over my floor. Rip. Right. We need a lip brush. We need to be saved. I can't do this on my own. Oh, I can't find it. Oh, this is so stressful. I literally was having a conversation with this with my, um, well, she's not my makeup artist, but I get all that I use to do my makeup for events because I get stressed and it makes me want to have a meltdown because I can't do anything right. So, yeah, no, I was saying to her, I was like, oh, I really like, you know, red lipstick, but I can't, like, pull it off. And she's like, well, you just need to, like, find a shade that, like, works for you and then just, like, go from there. Well, I haven't found one yet because I'm terrified of red lipstick. Okay, 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 we just have to do this. It's gonna look awful with like a nude colored lip liner. Like we could have had a red one, but no, Siri hates me. Why did I put the red in there? I thought, there's no way that Siri's gonna pick that, but he did. Thanks Molly Siri, you absolute poo head. I don't want to swear anymore in this video. I'm really stressed. Like. Look how red this is. I'm so pale, this isn't gonna work. But here we go. What is this even doing? I didn't even wear lip balm, so my lips are like so dry and I'm like so sad. I mean, it's a nice color. Okay. Oh, yikes. Miranda sings, I'm coming for you. Okay, so anyway, that was the brand MUA, which I have not used fully properly in like a really long time, but I really do rate their stuff. Um, what do you guys think of this combination? You know, I'm really not sure how I feel about it. Woo. I mean, despite the little breakdown that, you know, I was having over the red lipstick. I mean, I haven't even blended it in right. What am I doing? Right, sorry, one second. Fabulous. <laughs> oh my God. Okay, it's fine. We'll just move on. Anyway, so there you have it. I mean, I don't hate the red lipstick after that like breakdown that I had over it. Um, I mean, it actually looks really nice. It's not like really intense, but I mean, I just don't really think it goes with the eyeshadow. But you know, that just might be me. Um, but you know, I might actually try this combination again because it actually looked pretty decent after that whole drama of me hating it so um please like this bit put a thumbs up if you like this video um so that was sorry choosing no picking my makeup look and why do i keep messing up this side of my hair sorry i'm so distracted and so tired i really need sleep um but yes if you like this video please put a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll see you on the next one bye